Hello kittens, Silver here, and today I'm going to be bringing you a new collection video. And today I thought I'd showcase my Black Panther plush collection. Uh, most of these are by the Liosco or SOS company. Uh, I think actually all of them are with the exception of one Uni Toys one. So I'm going to start it off with this little guy. This He's like just a little munchkin, <laughs> this little Black Panther. He's by SOS. And you can see his... Uh, his hang tag in his ear just sort of uh, dwarfs him a little bit. It's <laughs> it's almost as high as he is. Um, so this this little guy is about uh, probably maybe eight or nine inches from nose to his end, uh, possibly around twelve if you count his tail. Um, but he's sort of just like a little beanie. So he's filled with beans, very floppy, and he also has his little SOS or save our space tush tag here and he was manufactured in 2003 actually so he's up there you wouldn't guess from his size he still looks like a baby to me but <laughs> um, really nice smooth black velvety fur and the little green eyes black plastic nose and these sort of clear plastic whiskers here so he's a cute little fella then we have the next size up is the approximately 12 inch I believe um, but much higher as you can see so this is the uh, this is another SOS Black Panther um, has a lot more height to him uh, very similar tag and I forgot to show in the other one but I believe both tags are identical on the inside they just give you a little bit of information about Black Panthers so you can, if it wants to focus, oop, probably not, but there you go. So if you want to take a look and read some of that, you can. And he's got that same SOS tush tag. And this one was also manufactured in 2003. What a coincidence. Oh wait, actually, no, I think that's just the, uh, well, oh no, no, his manufacture date is November 2016. Yeah, I got that, <laughs> I kind of got that backwards, I think. That was just a copyright date was 2003 so okay so this guy was 2011 so not quite as old as I thought he was um, but this one is actually really cool because if you look closely you can see he has some very subtle brown spotting in his coat which luckily the light is picking up very well here so it's sort of like this sort of coppery brown color which really gives him a lot of added dimension um, really really nice just not to have one solid opaque color like that um, and again he also has the green eyes and there is a slight lid to them which is a sort of trademark characteristic of SOS plush just in general and he also has the black plastic nose and the whiskers very lovely face and again really really soft very very plush material almost like a mink sort of material it's it's really really smooth and nicely textured so that's him then we have this set of Liosco Black Panthers uh, this would be the first one so this guy is probably the floppiest of the Black Panthers that I own um, and once again, you see the black plastic whiskers. His whiskers are actually, or the black plastic nose, I should say. And the whiskers are also black. Um, actually, this one's are as well. I think it's just the little guy that has the clear whiskers. Uh, but this one has eyes that are very, very striking and distinctive from the others. Um, they were sort of described to me as an emerald blue, which actually is a pretty good description, I think. And you can see all that faceting on the inside. <laughs> Hopefully not too much dust. <laughs> Every little bit of dust um, <laughs> shows up on black fur, of course. Uh, <laughs> so hopefully uh, yeah, hopefully we're not picking up on too much of that. Um, I do try to dust regularly, but it's so hard with, the, <laughs> with fur this color. Um, but anyway, so this guy is probably, uh, again, I would say uh, probably at least 13 inches from foot to back um, and then again the tail will add another few inches and this is his tush tag 
Right. This should say Liasco Collection. Ugh, the camera once again is... There we go. Liasco Collection. And this guy I got from the former owner of SOS. Um, this was one of the plush that he had had, I guess, sitting in his office right before he went out of business and needed to offload. So this was actually part of a set of three. So I'll show you the next one up, which would be... Um, almost uh, identical features to this one, but just in a different position, in sort of a laying position. As you can see, the uh, the back legs are sort of fixed in this pose, and but lots of beans, still very, you know, very floppy and movable. Um, this one too also is jam-packed with beans. Um, so yeah, just a slightly different position, but those same uh, blue green eyes and same uh, whiskers and black nose and the same lovely fur and these ones um, j are just a solid black unlike uh, this SOS one with the copper spots and then lastly we have the big kahuna from this set so let me just move these guys over so here he is <laughs> very imposing this one he is not to be trifled with this guy <laughs> no but he actually has a very friendly face um, yeah he just looks kind of wide-eyed and eager I think um, and this one is about about uh, 20 inches from foot to back and then his tail is pretty massive so altogether he's about 28 inches um, if you go from foot to tail so yeah, he is definitely a big boy, um, and he's also in that same sort of fixed laying pose that uh, this one is, um, or at least the back legs are, are sort of fixed. They're sort of, you know, kind of bent that way. Um, but again, tons of beans, super, super squishy, um, infinitely huggable. Uh, and the three of them all together really make uh, an, an adorable set, I think. Have a little family. And then lastly, uh, this one might be my personal favorite Black Panther. This is going to be my uh, Uni Toys Black Panther. So there he is. Now he has very, very pronounced copper spots, um, like the, uh, the SOS one over here. Um, this one you can really, really see in, in very high detail. Uh, and he has golden eyes, which sort of uh, separates him from the herd. And he has the clear plastic whiskers and the black plastic nose. And here is his hang tag here. Oh, that's funny. It's actually completely blank on the other side, <laughs> which is odd. I never even noticed that before. Um, yeah, kind of an inconveniently placed tag a bit so <laughs> I may actually just end up removing that um, but let's see here is his tush tag there's the uni toys oh well, we saw it for a second but uh, now let me see now I forgot to show the the tush tags on these guys but I think they're all pretty much identical Oop. yep Liasco collection so that is my entire set of Black Panther plushies uh, I had not anticipated on getting quite as many as I did. It was really only because they were offered to me by uh, by the SOS owner. Um, I didn't even know that these three even existed until he showed them the picture, but um, I kind of got them all in one package deal, so I didn't want to separate the family. That seemed cruel. Um, so that's them.